Yo, what is up guys? For today, I'm bringing you Destiny 2. Specifically, we're going to be talking about the Season Pass armor that I just got not too long ago. So, essentially, I'm going to be doing this video for a few reasons. One, because when I was trying to get this armor, I had specific builds in my head visually that I wanted to do for my Hunter and Titan. Not for my Warlock, because my Warlock I just gave up, but my Hunter specifically because, or my Titan specifically actually, because the armor from the season pass actually glows which with certain armor looked really cool and i will get into that but first we're going to get into the hunter and i'm going to show you the basic armor from that you get from the arm from the season pass and then the ornaments because as you guys can see i'm level 102 which means i got everything so as you guys can see i think this is very um knightish like you it looks like you're supposed to be a knight or like some sort of that type of thing and i think this was okay i thought i was like it's fine it's nothing too like too crazy in my opinion and let me show you guys what it looks like after you get the ornaments and i am back so this is essentially what you're you're gonna be getting from the season pass armor and i'm not gonna lie to you guys when i first initially saw this i was like yo that looks cool until i realized that every almost every piece of the armor from the ornaments is just adding one or two pieces at most so what i mean by that is like let's look at the cloak real quick cloak you're getting this i think this is horrible in my opinion it should have been like this like that not as long but like like that and then just end that right here so i don't like that already and they increase the hood a little more so like you guys will see right now i'll show you but this one only changes two things and yeah you guys can see i mean i do like that it it's longer but it's just that this really ruins it for me and honestly i don't really care about this to be honest so i think the cloaks are massively massively disappointing from this part from this part up here and you guys are going to see that that's kind of a thing that happens it's a trend with the warlock and the titan as well the titan being the most sad one of all so that this one changes two things and it's i promise you guys it's just gonna get like wow really like that's that's my initial thought when i when i first saw these so legs i thought were amazing until i saw that just added like two things i think yep so it adds this and this plus i think this right here yeah so this one's actually three things i'll give you that one two and three but still, I don't feel like it's enough change where it's like, wow, it's just literally adding an extra thing here, this here, and that. And I'm just like, okay, that's, that's cool, I guess. Like, sure. I think though what's worse is, is this, this one. Yeah, it is this one. This one, you can't change the green here. Granted, it's very small. But if I can notice it, then more people will notice it as well. So in my opinion, not cool at all. And for the cloak, all of it changes color, although what chooses to change color is very weird to me. So actually, I'll show you guys real quick. So for like me, I'm using Crucible Jack. It chose this to be like the pure red. And I was like, oh, I would not have chosen that. But OK, would have been amazing if I could choose my, what, what color changes. But I mean, we're not there yet. So whatever. Chess piece is probably the worst offender of them all because it does two things that I hate. One, it doesn't change much. It just gives you this and this because I think the purple thing's already there. Oh, it's not there either, huh? So this, this, and then the decal right there are the only things that are different, which I don't feel like a decal is enough for me to warrant. Like, okay, yeah, maybe this has three. It's a decal does not change much. So it's this and the bands right here. And what's worse is it doesn't change color. So that's a bad example. It's red. There's no purple on that. So this does not change color. Very disappointing. I do not like it when they make a certain piece of armor that just does not change color. And unfortunately, this is just like right in the face of everything. So I'll never use this chest piece, even though this is small. Granted, I know this is small. It still pisses me off arms another disappointing thing i think they add two things in this one let's 
so you guys can see the arms just adds literally this right here so that's very disappointing and then the other side i think the like the cloak thing comes off yeah and then you get the insignia but again that's not enough change for me to warrant being like oh that's cool and then this one has one from well two technically but it's really one the thing up here it is not there anymore so i mean like yeah people you could go and say oh no it's two because the eyes aren't glowing like i guess but the eyes are already there they just glow now so for me what do like what do i feel about this armor set i think it looks awesome this looks awesome but it's so so close to the bear the bitch the bitch version of this it's just too close to it it's really really way too close to it it would have been awesome if we had a different helmet design if the cloak was actually good and not this this gross thing uh the arms i think are nice but i do think that maybe we should have gotten one of the glow things here on our knuckles like they should have just added more ornamental stuff to it because i feel like it's just not adding enough i think the the boots are really the biggest offenders here because it's just literally the same thing almost it's just it's very close the pants don't even change and the boots don't even change either like that's the thing like it would have been cool if we had if the boots changed if we had like a cog here i don't know it just i don't feel like it's enough change for for them to warrant them doing i don't know man it's just that's how it is if you guys like it let me know in the comments below if you don't let me know in the comments below and i will be showing you guys the titan next i am back with my titan and let's see this armor honestly could have been better in my opinion i think the arms are too small the helmet's way too small and it's just like disproportional like there's just everything down here is heavy and then the arms and the helmet's just small i think like whoever designed that it's like dog i don't think you hit the mark on that one like it's really weird i i hate how it looks and i think the mark is pretty bad <laughs> I think the boots are extremely bad right here. Like, I look like a fucking transformer dog. Like this, this right here, transformer. Everything else, what, what the fuck? I think this is just bad. So let's get to the ornamental. And I am back. So essentially it went from this to this. And honestly, I love this one a lot more. And I don't know why it's so fucking shiny, but yeah, I think this looks amazing. But, and this is, this is the biggest fucking butt right now. As much as I do love all of this, there are two pieces of this these armor that do not change color. And immediately pisses me off because they're my actually two of my favorite ones. So let's look at the cloak or the mark real quick and ultimately i love this cloak this cloak is actually really fucking awesome i love it it looks so good compared to like the other one this one looks amazing my issue with it is the fact that it does not change color here this this does not change color guys the 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 feathers do not change color and it pisses me off and it's small yeah i know it's small but i notice it and this this is the thing you guys have probably noticed by now is that i notice the smallest things because i just i really like to get into the build craft of like looking good i really love to get into that whole section of just like looking my making my guardian look as cool as possible and if colors do not match i get really fucking mad so obviously this is one thing that's just such a huge negative for me Next one is this one. This one does not change color as well. Specifically, right here. The blue does never, it doesn't change color. And I don't fucking know why. It kills my soul. Especially like, look at this glow. It's so good. This is actually what I was gonna go for, this green. But unfortunately the blue doesn't change color. So I can't use this anymore. 
This chess piece is fine. It's fine. I don't really mind it all too well. And actually, if we go back to the cloak, show you guys the difference. I totally forgot about that. But look at that. Very bare. Very bare. The boots are probably the worst because you guys are just going to notice that one part changes and that's it. And I was just like, whoa, okay. It's literally just, uh, just this right here. That's it. Changes color and then that's it. And it's funny too because you can actually change the... Oh no, you, never mind. I was going to say you can change the blue on that, but I guess I'm wrong. Horrible. And then the chest piece, which I think is fine, but it all just adds, I think, this piece and then this piece up here. Yep, so two pieces, and and the weird thing is these this purple thing actually does change color for the Titans, which is super weird because like, why choose the t why choose the hunters that can't have that, but then switch it for the Titans? It's so weird. Oh no, we already saw that. So arms, uh, two things change as well, which is basically. This and then this on both sides. So look at that again for this side. It's literally just that's it. So unfortunately, this is very basic as well. And all the colors change on this one as well. But still very disappointing. Just one piece. And then this was probably the coolest one from the whole set is the helmet. But in my opinion, the helmet should have stopped up like right here and then go down like that. I would have loved it if it was a little bit more like that, but the fact that it just stops right there is just really weird to me. It's very jarring. So I don't like it, but I mean, whatever to each their own. This one actually does change a lot, but because this one's so barren that, I mean, obviously it has to change. And it's really cool because it, it adds this right here. It adds the top part and it makes it longer here. So I ultimately do like this one a lot, but again, this, almost had nothing to it so if it did not add much to it i would have been disappointing but this is probably one of my favorite helmets for the titans i think it's probably their coolest helmet so far and yeah actually this is how my titans are even my titans looking right now which is sad considering that i'm not even using the helmet because it's just so bad or not bad i'm sorry but it's just that i can't use these legs because they fuck everything up and there and this is pretty much how my titans looking right now because the purple doesn't change color which means i had to change all this from green to purple to match the cloak and even then if i want to match with this one i'm gonna have to do blue so that's a lot of fun i love i love it when they tell me what colors i can and cannot use so let's go to the warlock and last but not least, we have the Warlocks, which is looking very barren as well. It looks super, super basic. Obviously, has to look ba basic so that they can take pieces of the armor that they already made and just make it look... That's... Uh, real, real quick, I think that's how they're making this armor. I think the fact that, like, they'll make a really cool armor set look really cool. And then they'll, like, take stuff away, like... They'll have like, all right, cool. It looks really amazing. Now start taking all the ornamental stuff out. And then that's the basic armor. That's it. So that's what I think they do. I could be wrong, but probably not. But yeah, maybe. So yeah, let's look at this real quick. I think this is okay. I actually use this helmet like just as is because of a specific color that I'm going for. But other than that, I think this is okay. It gets really bad after we show, after I show you like the ornamental stuff and even like how it is now it clips through a few armor sets so i'll show you guys in a bit but ultimately i will show you guys the ornamentals right now and here is the warlocks i think the warlocks have a really cool armor set as well they all they, they all really have really awesome ones but the fact that it clips right here and without any other armor this is the armor that it comes with it's already clipping means i'm already angry because i don't like clipping especially when it's like a premium skin like this that takes a hundred levels to unlock the fact that there's clipping bungee come on dog that's not cool so let's look at the bond real quick and again that actually does not look like it's clipping but it is which is 
okay, I guess, whatever. We live in a world that that's fine. And it just adds uh, stuff to it. It's fine, I guess. I mean, it's a bond. I don't expect much from bonds anymore. They're all the same. But let's look at the legs. This is where it actually gets really disappointing uh, for a lot of reasons. So first and foremost, it's just uh, two pieces. Technically one, it's just the, the, the guards, the knee guards. That's it. That's really it, guys. <laughs> oh my God, like it's just the knee guards, bro. What the fuck? <laughs> so that's disappointment number one. Disappointment number two is actually the amount of clipping this has is grotesque. Like what the actual fuck? This is bad. I was actually gonna pair these two together because it looks cool, but then I started noticing that and I was like, oh, even here too. I was like, what the fuck, bro? So that's cool. Love it when that happens. And it clips even through the fucking base armor. So that's cool as well. And I don't think the Warlocks got any armor that doesn't change color, if I remember correctly. Yeah, I don't think they did, so kudos for them. The chest piece is actually one of the better pieces of all the armors, actually, because it actually does change quite a bit. So first and foremost, I'm going to change the color so you guys can actually see what I'm talking about. To a color... Yeah. So you guys can see the really good glow right there. The, be the marks right here, whatever these are called, they do not change color, or they do change color as well. And ultimately, the other cool thing is that it just changes a lot of the armor. So you get this, 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 the chest glows, and I think this as well. So you do get quite a bit, and you actually get the, the shoulder guard as well. So you do get a lot with this, and I don't have anything to com complain about. Their chest piece is really good. They changed a lot of it and made it look really cool. So yeah do i think they took pieces from already existing this like do i think that they took pieces from this armor and just made it into this yes definitely i do feel that but i mean it's enough change where i'm like damn that's a lot of stuff that you you guys uh did cool arms are really disappointing but that's a warlock thing not a artistic thing warlocks uh, clipping of course but this it's just way too small for it to be anything cool so i don't knock bungee off of that for for that because it's a limitation with the class that itself although i don't remember that being that bad in destiny one but i may be wrong and the helmet is probably the worst part from all the helmets because this is what the fuck it would have been so cool if like it ended like like this and then down like just make it like that or like that but the fact that they just kind of like it feels like they just got bored and stopped there so for me it would have been cool if they went high not like super high up here but like like this and then down and then have the light go all the way down because this just looks fucking weird so i'm never probably gonna ever wear all of this together most likely it's probably gonna be what i'm already wearing which is this right here Actually, not the chest piece. I don't wear that. It's probably going to be this. Uh, this is the what my warlock has been looking like. And I'll actually show you my guys my hunter since I did not show you my hunter. So I'll be right back. And that's pretty much the video, guys. Uh, in my personal opinion, the ornaments are kind of awesome. But at the same time, whatever's. Like, the titans have a really cool armor set, which is ruined by color colors that do not change. And the hunters are, the, I think the hunters is the most, you can see the difference between the armor and the non-armor or the ornament and the non-ornament because they, theirs is just very like, oh, you could tell like it's just the same thing, but with just like hints of like ornaments sprinkled at, like here and there. So what am I going to be wearing it? Obviously, as you guys can tell, I'm not wearing it right here, nor do I wear it on me on my other hunter armor set because i have a few hunter um sets that i wear for my hunter like this one as well so all my classes usually have two or three armor sets that i like cater to like this is mostly if i want to do pvp my stats don't don't uh 
reflect that but this is like in my head like oh this is how my hunter looks because i i've loved to make my hunter look cool and my all of my other classes since like destiny one so the fact that i have to buy ornaments and shit or level them up level up my premium shit to 100 is just a little jarring for me when i could just go back in destiny one and just farm an armor set but here we are in the future where uh 45 dollars for one one class is a fucking thing right here so what do i think about the premium armor set i think it's cool but i just don't like the limitations that bungie puts on the titans and the hunters to a certain uh extent i do think that the hunters or the titans shoulder i mean uh, the titans legs and mark should not be like color specific i don't know why they did that but whatever what the fuck do i know let me know in the comments below if you guys like the armor i wanted to show you guys just so you guys can get an idea of what the armor would look like and if you guys just were curious about it if you guys want to follow me on my social media outlets links are in the description below thank you everyone for the constant support and follows i hit a 300 subscribers and i can be i'm, I'm happy so other than that we'll see you guys later